Hello and welcome to Hawk's YouTube channel and the TU5 series turbidimeters videos. My name is Jenny Jones and I'm the product manager for process turbidimeters here at Hawk. Today we'll be going over unboxing the next standard in the evolution of turbidity, the TU5 series family of turbidimeters. Let's start by unpacking an online turbidimeter. An online TU5 series turb receives its power from an SC controller. If you're not going to be connecting your TU5 series turbidimeter to an existing controller, make sure that you go ahead and add one onto your order. The packing list may be included in a plastic sleeve on the outside of the box, or it may be included at the top of the box when it's first opened. This one is here on the outside. Go ahead and remove the packing slip and compare the numbers on your packing slip to the number on the outside of the box. These part numbers may differ. Pax internal processes use different numbers between manufacturing and shipping and I'll spend the next minute or so explaining the difference. The first section of the part number, the LXG or LXV dot two digits, is for specific routing instructions internally for the TU5 series in Hoxton manufacturing. If these characters are different, that's okay. You'll want to pay attention to the last five digits of the part number. These detail specific information about the instrument and its configuration. If a flow meter was ordered with the instrument, the first digit will show A on the label and two on your part number on the packing list. If an automatic cleaning module was ordered, the first digit will show B here on the label and three or five in your part number on the packing list. If no accessories were ordered with the instrument at all, both the label and the packing list will show one on that first digit. These accessories can also be ordered after initial purchase and will be detailed in another video. The remaining digits will be identical. Once you've verified the part number, it's time to open the instrument. Let's go ahead and actually open the box. I've pre-cut the tape already. Remove the top cover and go ahead and pull the online turb out of the box. We'll go ahead and also remove the plastic covering. In this case, we have a TU5400SC. You'll see the inlet and outlet ports for the instrument tubing, as well as screws right here that provide easy access to clean the vial without needing to disassemble the instrument. On the back of the turb, you'll see four different channels that allow easy routing for accessories that may be attached later in the process. In addition, the front of this instrument has a picture showing that this particular turb is equipped with RFID for calibration and easy comparison between the online and laboratory versions of the TU5s. Before continuing, Verify that the part number and serial number on the back of the instrument match the label on the outside of the box. The remaining items that come with the TU5300 or TU5400 turbs come in a smaller box that's on the out, outside of the larger pack. Inside the box are the remaining parts and accessories that you'll need to install your turb. You, it'll come with the certificate of a final inspection, which gives you information saying that the, the turb left the factory exactly like it, where it was supposed to. You'll have the actual uh, user manual. We have the maintenance bracket, part number LZY873, that makes it really easy to actually move the process head for easy cleaning and replacement of the vials. This actually only comes standard with the TU5400. So if this is something that you think that you would be useful for you and you've got a TU5300, it is something that's ordered separately. We have the desiccate cartridge that keeps the inside of your turb vial compartment nice and dry. There's the flow regulator that helps to, uh, along with its tubing, that helps to create back pressure and reduce bubbles in your sample. The service, service vial removal tool that makes it easy to remove the vial on the ins inside of the instrument for um, easy replacement. The hot water screw set for um, warmer water applications. And finally, the actual mounting bracket along with its associated hardware in case you decide to actually mount, mount the uh, instrument with the bracket. The TU5400 that we unboxed here is an ISO version turbidimeter. EPA versions of the TU 53 and 5400 process turbidimeters come with a 500 milliliter bottle of StableCal as well as a syringe for easy calibration. One of the strengths of the TU 5 series family is the ability to match readings in between your online and laboratory turbidimeters. 
The TU5200 is the only turbidimeter that has an identical analytical unit to the TU5300 or TU5400SC online turbidimeter, giving you the opportunity to compare readings between the online turb and the lab. We'll go ahead and unpack the TU5200 next. While unpacking the TU5200, make sure to again compare part numbers on the box in the packing list. So you'll go ahead and remove the foam that's sitting here at the top to help keep the instrument from moving during shipment. Lift the TU5200 out of the box. Remove the protective plastic. And set the instrument in the location where it will actually be installed. You'll notice the TU5200's large display, convenient front USB port, and lid that covers the identical analytical measuring unit to the online TU5 turbinimeter. Like the TU5400 earlier, this instrument can be equipped with RFID for comparison between online and lab, as well as ease of starting calibration. Again, verify that the part number and serial number on the back of the instrument matches the label on the outside of the box. The remaining items that are shipped with the TU5200 are included in a smaller box that's placed under the instrument. Remove the additional foam to uncover this smaller box. The smaller box contains the instrument's certificate of conformance to make sure that it left the factory exactly like it should, the instrument user manual, a power supply with six different power plug adapters, we'll cover that in the installation video a little bit more, a dust cover to keep the instrument clean when not in use, a vial stand to help make sure that you keep the um, instrument vials off of any flat surface. Two additional sample cells. In addition, the TU5200 comes with a 20 NTU calibration standard, a 600 NTU calibration standard, and a 10 NTU verification standard. For TU5200s equipped with RFID, these sample cells also are equipped with RFID to make calibration and verification even easier. With both instruments unboxed, it's time to start installation, which will be covered in a separate video done by Hawks Technical Training Center. Even during installation, the TU5 series does give you everything about turbidity faster. Thank you for watching.